Yo, what's going on guys? It's Tank TV here. Got another another live commentary coming at you. This one's from Monday Night Commentary. It's a highlight from uh, one of our past Monday Night Commentaries. It's Game 6. Sometimes we always do what we look for five games. This one, it was barn burner of a night. Okay, just came back from vacation. Glad to be back with you all. So I want to share this one on the YouTube as well. This is the highlight. This is the extra, the encore game. Game 6, Monday Night Commentary. Hope you guys enjoy it. Make sure to like, make sure to subscribe, guys. It would mean a lot to me. Really appreciate it. Appreciate all the love. As always, guys, thank you so much. Enjoy. You know what time it is. Here we go, baby. Game 6, Monday Night Commentary. A boogie, 954901. Gonna pick up a scav. Forgot to put his area code on the phone over there. <laughs> yeah, that's just a little off the mark. <laughs> I ain't watching two weeks and then I was confused like it's the same thing. Yeah, for a minute, cheap boy, I was literally like, uh. <laughs> it's like, well, I'm just a dude that looks a lot like Frank just filling in in the meantime. <laughs> Boogie just gonna work on the scab here. Not, not really many people inside of. Well, it looked like a few did drop in the lumber, but the south skirts right here normally looted, but unlooted here. You're gonna have a nice time picking up a lot of cash so far, too. 3,200 already. Full plates. Got an extra one. Scavs almost completed. Right out front there. The blue MG82. Consider it game over. We'll be right near loadout money, if not at loadout money after the scavs completed. Not sure what he's... I don't know what he's doing there! Yeah, <laughs> I don't know either, Greg. Also, for anybody new, that's my co-host, Greg the Grim Reaper. We also have our on-field reporter, Derek. He's out there. We haven't checked in on him in a little bit. Uh, apparently, uh, Derek, after game one, uh, he was confused by our the accent we, we were using. And... Uh, <laughs> so he decided to just take a break because he couldn't assist and he got sunburned. And Daniel's currently lathering on some suntan lotion on him Marked and some target. aloe. Oh yeah, Frank, that's exactly what happened. I went and laid out. I, I, I am crispy right now. I am totally burnt. I'm red as a lobster. Well, keep keep having Daniel lather that on for you. <laughs> and hopefully it's not that bad. It gets better soon for you, Derek. Sorry to hear it. Oh, I'm hoping it turns into a pretty sweet tan. Hopefully, Derek. Unbelievable. Derek just been off his game lately. You're not wrong, Greg. Uh, Boogie. Closing in. Now he's going to pop a dead silence. He's 125 meters away from this most wanted. I don't know if he's just trying to get there quickly. He's working with that Swiss and the MG. He's going to be slow as piss, so maybe this will help him speed up a little bit. But looks like the most wanted moving decently slow. This might be a, a complete waste of that. Uh, it, again, he, he's using it to catch up a little bit, but... Probably would have been a better idea to use it after he got in tight on the most wanted. Now he's inside on him. Oh, nothing else matters here. MG82, though. Like we said, goodbye, sucker. He's gone. Dead in 62nd place. Boogie picks up a second kill. And like we said, MG82, the blue one. GG's. It's already over. He has 15k. Doesn't even need a loadout at this point. He's got the Swiss, which that one, ground loot, the, the purple one. Epic one is nasty, but the MG82, that's all you need. You can shoot with his eyes closed. <laughs> Sorry to Derek. <laughs> the sun is dangerous in Verdansk. <laughs> You're telling me you should see my stomach right now. You can fry an egg on it. <laughs> Jesus, the details he's telling us. I, 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 I know. <laughs> Even though I would like to see that. Oh, you want me to try? No, no, Derek. You're not going to try. No, no. Daniel can run over. No, 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 no. Greg. Sorry. Just say it would be cool. <laughs> Venom art. Edith, what the hell? <laughs> 50 people left in the game. 
Boogie's still on the outskirts of Lumber. Free loadout dropping. He's just been looting literally everything in this area. He's up to the buy station. Which buy station did he ping? He's that far from a buy station? There is one to the left and lower uh, lower than that in, the, in farmland, on the top of farmland. But he's pinged one near Bunker. Circle, northwest or northeast corner of the map. Salt mine, we're looking at an array. About 40% uh, of that going to be off the map. Boogie, good pickup his loadout. Mac 10 comes out. Heartbeat sensor, a.k.a. it's Generation 1 iPad. He's got eight plates in his satchel with dead silence and a Semtex. And, oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Frank. I know, I know, buddy. Start the clock. Car 98, Mac 10, Boogie. Not even in the circle yet. 54 seconds before the second circle closes. I mean, Greg, the camper clock can only be 40, 50 seconds long. Hold up, wait a second. Who was that guy? Oh, Boogie had all day to shoot and he waited too long. The hesitator is the masturbator. And look out, car shot comes back at Boogie. He's down to about 20%. Oh my God. He's at 40 HP just standing in the window casually. But then decides to finally back up and replay. He had an opportunity to drop the opponent there in the lurch. Operator skin didn't take the shot and he's paid for it now again th that lurch is on the most perfect of headies on that position And you saw him just bounce out to the right here Keep her clock at 40 seconds <laughs> Just hit the button already. Yeah, he doesn't know he, he I'll hit it Greg Oh, he started to move <laughs> 30 se it was only 30 seconds another dead silence from boogie coming out Look out from the left, though. He's getting drilled, almost completely plated. Trying to fire some Mac-10 shots back. I don't think that's the other opponent. I don't think that's the Lurch skin. We'll find out here, unless he doubled back. He definitely went He went from the left to the right, rotating more towards the inner side of circle. I think this is somebody just working in here. Heartbeat sensor comes out. We'll get a ping. And even look at where it came out at. Look down to his left here with the car. Using the bush for a cover here. Heartbeat sensor. He's coming in closer here. Mac-10 out now. Didn't even fully plate. He's got to look out. He's only got two plates on now. Two plates and not a fully loaded Mac-10. Got to be careful. Here comes the rotation around the ra the back left of that garage. He's going to rotate to that side. Opponent's definitely going to hear his footsteps here. Heartbeat sensor. Just a double check again. And oh, my God. Goodbye, sucker. We saw him earlier. Welcome back to the game. And a quick two-tap on Boogie. Never had a chance. Tap, tap, tap a -roo. Good night. He's rocking the AS foul with the 10 mag on it. And just unloaded. Fourth kill for goodbye sucker. 12,000 in hand. Eight plates. Two thermites. An iPad. And dead silence. And he has frozen. And he's back. Haven't said it yet, but hello to all the new followers of Thunder. I'm glad you could all be here and happy to be a part of one of the greatest fish communities. Yo, Smick. My fucking dude, bro. Thank you, bro. Thank you, man. Very kind, bro. Very kind. Spicy Val Rasta, indubitably, bro. Popped off with that thing. Quick one-two tap. Gotta love it. Goodbye, sucker. I did pick up somebody on his iPad. I think it's a. I think it's a. It's a Kindle. You think it's a Kindle Fire, Greg? Let's let's see if he pulls it back out. We'll take a second look here. Right in front of him, though. Oh my God, the Val is potent as shit. TikTok camp snipes. Might find that one on TikTok later from Goodbye Sucker. Just, just, I mean, walks in the window. Just, I mean, that's a clip to show the vow with 10 rounds. Holy shit, tits. Absolutely buries the second opponent that we've seen. Fifth kill now. 29 left in the game. Second circle. Minute 20 seconds away from closing now. Still northwest side of the map. 14K in hand. He's got to find a buy station. Fire sale engaged. Hops on the ATV, I'd imagine. Yeah, he's going to ping that. A yep, that's the only one in the area, really, up near the bunker. It's going to be a risky one, especially with a fire sale going on. A very popular area. Highly populated. Schmucky, what's happening, bro? I follow you on TikTok and on here. But first time I've been on your stream, this is gold. Love it. Yo, Schmucky333. Appreciate it, bro. Thank you, man. Thank you, thank you. He is going to pull up here. Let's see if anybody's already here. So, I mean, right now with that foul, the way he's shooting the damn thing, I don't think he needs to worry. Did that guy shoot at him? He's got a kilo with 100 rounds. This is the most ridiculous loadout. <laughs> kilo with 100 rounds and an AS foul. 
Yeah, I don't know what just happened there. I looked away for a brief second. Oh, wait. It's only got five kills. Precision airstrike comes out on the hillside, too. He didn't really... He didn't buy up that much. He didn't get a self-res, which would be free. He didn't buy it. Interesting. Didn't get his free self-res. Didn't even pop a UAV. Just bought two precision airstrikes. He still has plenty of cash, but he spent like $1,400 out of the 12 k he had in hand. Great build a new meta. 100-round kilo. Dude... I'm gonna have to try out this thing. Yo, Schmucky, my dude, bro. Thank you for the sub, my man. Tier 1 sub coming in. Much appreciated. Tank love, brother. Thank you, man. Taking the wheel. I'm confused. Now he buys the self-res. He, he takes an ammo box, and he leaves a dead silence. I, with the AS Val shooting 10 round, ma 10 round clips and a kilo with a 100 round mag on it, I don't think he's going to need much ammo technically. He's just shooting the Val for the most part. But to each his own, again, the ammo box he has a Kindle Fire. As Greg did call correctly. I told you it was a Kindle Fire! As we know, Kindle Fire has a little bit of better of a Wi Fi connection inside of Verdansky. Somebody on top of the big red building here. Heartbeat says they're going to come out, nothing brewing. A Kindle Fire! <laughs> No ticks on this one. Go sit up top. But he bought the self I mean, he has the money, so it's not like he's going to end up spending this, but it seems like a little, little bit of a misplay on the, on, the, on the money buying there. But... Yo, Acid, what's good, bro? How we doing? About to go make a 10-round ASV. I know, right? I, I, this needs to be tried. Actually, you know, we were running the other day, but I switched off it because it kind of was weird, but... The FAMOS, the Modern Warfare from Moss on single fire is actually kind of nasty. <laughs> it's actually pretty nasty. I think I might try it again. I'm going to switch up the build on it. I had like a 50 round mag and I, you don't need the, that mag when you're shooting at single fire. I think a 30 round would be just fine. Thunder Grenade comes in. Look out. Goodbye sucker. It's going to get picked up. He might be picked up on a heartbeat sensor here. He's got to be careful. Right in front of him. No, the AS Val's not going to do it. Comax Pilot. Answers back. We see the Val from Goodbye Sucker doing an insane amount of damage, insane amount of work, but the A, but the XM4. Oh boy, for Comax Pilot answers back. 15 people left in the game, just like that. Minute and 40 seconds before the third circle closes. A got the MG82 on backup with an XM4. Interesting build as well here, but as we've seen, this X the MG82 will just simply win you a game by itself. Put it on a mount. And just point and click with your eyes closed. And you'll bury somebody. 14 people left. Five kills. He has a self-res. Eight plates. No gas masks. No stun grenades either. Precision air strike and two Semtex for him. Circle. Hard shifts again. North. Way north. Half the map off the line there. You see, right there we had a rover fire up. That's off the map now. Somebody's moving around in that. Getting to maybe a better... There you go. Rover shows back up. They moved up just a little bit. But we already got people up on the hillside. 13 people left. One more fell. Jeep on this side of the map. A lot of people working on this backside. We're going up there again. This is maybe the third time today we've seen the circle shift that way. Acid, my man. Thank you for the sub, bro. Thank you, thank you, thank you, brother. Much appreciated. Welcome back, dude. It's a bold move, Cotton. Let's see how it plays out. Yeah, we got recon. Ross, that's right. the blueprint I have. I have that exact blueprint. Looks like, wait, guess who's back? In the loadout up top, Riot Shield comes out. Semtex grenade, though. No toxic Apollo 7. I thought that might have been... That might have been him back from the depths of hell from the Gouge to seek revenge there with the Val. But no, no, no. Wait, wait a minute. Hold up. Shots coming in towards Pilot. Now he's under some fire. Here comes the MG82, though. Out to the right, you can see the opponent almost top 10 stitch, Greg. Almost, baby. Where it all counts. 17 seconds for the third circle closes. Precision airstrike to cover Comax's move here to the right. Get a hop in the rover and get the hell out of Dodge. Watch out, though. He might take some shots. Oh, shots from the right, too. Multiple opponents there. Great work to just hop in the rover and get the fuck out of there and reset. He has an opponent off to his left and an opponent off to the right. And he pulls off to the side. This is going to narrow it down here. He's going to be able to just break this down so he doesn't get a pinch. Just try to fight one at a time now. Interesting to see where that... That third party came from last second. They were down on his left there. Here's a sniper shot ring out. Not towards Comax Pilot's direction just yet, so. 
Interesting to see. He lost about half a plate there. He will replay it up. Take a look at the circle. My god. Holy shit, tits! Yeah, that's way out there. Way out there. Oh, I mean, we're looking down. This circle's closing down on the back end of the train tracks, for Christ's sake. This is gonna be wild. <laughs> I use uh, Modern Warfare from Awesome Multiplayer Single Fire. I use the primary and secondary. Uh, I, would I tried it out as a primary. New OMG makes it a game crash. Really, Acid? Yeah, this MG82 is, just, is unbelievably broken. We need a nerf sooner, sooner than later. Uh, we had Season 3 with the greatest meta of all time. No meta. And now we have right back to just broken weapons. But I see it change quick. Oh, it should. I, I, I could see them doing this quickly. Raven's been doing a fantastic job, so I'm not that worried about it. But, um, okay, Ravage. Yeah, the FAMAS. Yeah, so I tried it. He's going to take shots from one of the other buildings. This whole area is a little... Oh, my God. Look at that weapon. Mike Hawk 412 will fall to the MG82. Unbelievable. 11 people left, 7 kills now for Comax Pilot. That was ridiculous. Uh, Viking, no, we are not. Yeah, they were better for like a day. That's true, Edith. So you're saying you have a chance? <laughs> Viking. <laughs> Um, but Ramage, yeah, I was using that with, like, a MAC-10, uh, with my secondary. Look out from behind again! Pilot has, had just from, from the get-go, just feels like after, after he, he won that fight, there was just constantly somebody in behind him. He had the, the, the loadout that landed on top of the gas station roof, the other, the other team that came from the side, and then down below, behind him, from the, near the silo area, uh, unbelievable. And then the other building, he was just getting hit from every which way. And he's gone. Back to the lobby, sir. Trip and trip 07 with eight kills. And guess what, Greg? Top 10 situation. Let's go, baby. Look at how he's got stopping power in the back 10. Oh, boy. That's something you don't see too much of anymore. Not a lot of stopping power being seen. And trust me, I love it. I love it. Even out the game, take out some RNG. I love it. Right out in front, shots were off the mark for Trip and Trip. When he first started shooting there, the far shots, they were nice. He held the recoil beautifully, but he was just off to the right and twisted KG. Didn't miss. Picks him up. Six kill for him. Trip and Trip finishes the ninth. Eight, eight opponents left. Circle showing again back to that side. This I've never even seen it close this far back. This is crazy. I've seen it come back right at about this area here. I've never seen it this far back on this on this side of the map, on that train track area. Wild finish incoming. I'm excited, Greg. Oh, this is going to be fucking nuts. Uh, but yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, so I switched off of it. I switched back off of it because I kind of, I do want to try it out again, though. And I want to make some, I want to do something real goofy with that FAMAS single fire. Put it, leave the 30 round mag on it and do some goofy stuff. But yeah, I, uh. I liked it. I, I'm, I'm trying this Val out. 10 round uh, Val. Especially in solos. Without a doubt. Opponent just parachuted in from the depths of hell. Where did he come from? Cold War MP5s. Now this is the ground loot one. He doesn't have a reloader. Only 29 shots in the clip. Look out. Oh, it's Comex Pilot. Back from the depths of hell. But Twisted KG said, ah. ah. Oh, my. Not today, sir. Six opponents left in the game. Five others. Outside of Twisted KG. Seventh kill now. Has potential for a dub dig dub. Oh, watch those ankles. Nearly slaughtered his ankles there. Oh, Frank, I tried to get an interview with Twisted, but he's moving around too much in my sunburn. He's killing me. It's fine, Derek. You've done great today. Honestly, I haven't done much today. What was that? No, nothing, Derek. Great work. Say, d tell Daniel he did just fantastic. Make sure he continues to owl you, owl, owl you up. Yeah. Uh, do you want to talk to... No, we don't want to talk. We don't talk to Daniel. What was that? Nothing. Jesus Christ, Derek. <laughs> Shots up the back of the hill from the Krieg. The Krieg. An old outside dog, CLE, will fall. Fifth place for him. Four people left in the game. Oh, I got Daniel if you want. Derek, take care of your sunburn, and thanks for your work in Verdansk. <laughs> All right, thanks, Frank. That's awesome, Viking. Congratulations, bro.
early congratulations on the anniversary, man. That's nice. That's awesome, bro. M13 recoil with... Yeah, dude. Exactly, bro. Exactly, Ramage. That's a perfect way to explain that gun right now. MG82 is quite literally the M13 with recoil in the Bruin power. Totally agree. Shots from behind! Twisted KG was playing well, but look out! Slippery snake stuck in behind him, and the knife comes in from ass... Ask. We're now on Asp. Asp. <laughs> With a Farah. Nine kills for him. Three people left in the game. Off to his left. I believe there was one. It could have been the gas closing in. I, hard left. Yes, a car shot comes in right next to his ear. He's got a gross in behind that Farah. Now he's got a dip, dodge, duck, and dive, and dip, and dodge. He's just scooting around the map now. Hops down, gets away from him there. That was close call. Up to his left. Didn't see him. An opponent made a mistake and missed. Unfortunate there, too. Shots were pretty good, except for some of them were just hitting the rock by accident there. That's how the game kind of functions. Car look out. Shot. It's a sniper glint in. He is going to duck. Back and hold here. Circle is favorable for him. But where is the third opponent? Asp, Asp was working on that backside. He was going the slippery snake route. But guess who? All the way up on the opposite side. Guess what it is, Greg? It's a pizza formation. We have a pizza formation, ladies and gentlemen. Two snipers on Asp. Asp up to his right and up to his left. Asp is at the bottom of the triangle of the pizza right now. And he's got to get up to the crust. He's in some trouble here. Two snipers raining down on him. He's found himself low here. Luckily, the left sniper is just taking his time. Well, he, what he's got to hope for is those two start to engage each other, and then he can make a play. But look out. There's the shots in. He's going to get cracked down to 75% health. Goes prone, but he's in trouble. He's got a toothpick of a tree in front of him. Now the shot's from the right. You can see the opponent just reaching over the edge. Shot comes in and draws him. Asp, asp is now going to try to self res It's not going to fucking matter. Salty horn wallet, I think. 1v1 situation, possibly. What is happening now? Oh, that's it! What the fuck? It just ends that way! What happened to the other guy? We totally had a piece of formation. Viking Horn is sounded. GG's in the last game. But what in the hell? Did he hit the snipe shot across? I only heard two sniper shots. It was the one that dropped him and the one that thirsted him. But Salty Hamwall, we gotta see if we get a post game with him here. What in the world? Salty, you there, bro? Yo, Salty. Hey, what's up? Hey, what what happened at the end there? What happened to the guy on the other side with the sniper rifle? You hit him too? Yeah, he was, he was shielding up apparently. I guess you did some damage to him. I only uh, hit him once and it, it knocked him. Okay, what about that was the guy down low? What about the guy on the other the other side? I sniped him when he was uh, sniping the other dude. Okay, there you go. All right, sweet. Nice work then. GG's, bro. Well played. Thanks, bro. Yeah, Thanks, have a bro. good one. Takes another shot, just misses. Look at this, Fred. Oh, my. It's insane. Oh.